Okay, so if you guys didn't see in my last video, I messed up hard. I spent all my 500 mil on pink dye. If you guys want, you can go check my last video. I kind of explained everything there. I spent the 500 mil out of my series because your boy wanted some collectible. Yeah, Avi, these waste mans can't compare to my level. I even asked Simon himself and he said no. Nope. Elizabeth taking everybody's mom's credit cards and she can't even compete. I asked the agent and his master and they don't even have enough items to compete with my collectible. You would assume that the bazaar and the agent have so much. Yeah, nope. But surely the bit. Nope. Not even close. And yeah, you're right. Nobody has these cake soles made by Mini Clune himself. So they're about, I don't know, five quintillion. I heard you guys talking about refraction and this guy being the richest person in the game. So I had to go to Sky Shio and look at this guy's account. I see these weak, low tier, low level armor on his auction house. I even took a look at this guy's protector set and it's just embarrassing. All of his talismans are uncommon or common. This guy has like five duplicates of the farming talisman. Somebody tell him that they don't stack. His pet game is whack. I think he only has like one or two legendaries. Even Mind Tricks tried to give a desperate attempt of taking over my wealth. Let's listen to Squid here negotiating a deal to help Mind Tricks. You do how much? You got $50? You could have 50 mil. You, you you see that? Do you also don't have to buy it? Yeah, it is a scam. You're right. Up to you. Hey, fifty dollars? You could have fifty mil. Up to you. I honestly didn't know buying these would shake up the high pixel skywalk community so much. I guess you could simply say that I'm just built different. High caliber, high octane, royal blood, superior DNA, just unmatchable. But for real, if you're not subscribed, please make sure only 75% of you are subscribed. Okay, let's get back onto the video, boys. Okay, so I disappointed you all, and I get it, boys. I am so sorry. You know, I spent all my money on those cosmetics, and I'm at zero coins. Okay, if I have to be honest, I'm at 110 mil, but that's just not the point. We're backtracked, and we need to get back to where we were. But I gotta tell you something first. You guys look at my island, you can see that I have all the chests fully organized and everything that I need. But if you guys come over to this corner, it looks pretty lonely. And the reason for that is because now I'm going to be restarting the series, but I'm going to be putting some changes on it. So at the very beginning of the series, we had like all these utility items that we could use that would help like benefit us with almost anything in the game. Midas Sword, which was really good back in the day, but it's not so much because the Livid Dagger and the Shadow Fury overtake it. The Flower of Truth and the Spirit Scepter, which is far more superior inside dungeons. We also had all these armor sets just readily available for us that we could use at any time, which basically means if I actually wanted to just do something that was currently meta because it was just gonna give so much money I could just do it where for you guys that would be an absolute pain to start fresh you guys don't have superior you guys don't have elegant tux just readily available tier 12 no oh you guys want to go ahead and fish at the best efficiency with renowned yeah you don't have that either so to a certain extent the challenge was a little bit unfair just in some way shapes and forms it wasn't like crazy ridiculous but if we're gonna make this series one bill let's just make it the hardest one bill ever I'm not gonna put any limitations on my account like not using the auction house or I can't can't use the bazaar but instead I'm gonna go ahead and remove some progress off my account to make it a little bit harder so that way I would actually have to buy some of the items that you guys would actually have to work for not just have them already at this point I should probably just start a new account from zero and show you guys how easy this game really is but maybe I can save that series for a different time instead if you guys know me best one of my main goals is to get skill average 50 get all the pets level 100 and I do want to achieve being one of the richest players in the game so until I unlock that then don't really expect any other series until then let's go ahead and grab some chests and some trap chests left or right left or right we'll go with right okay this is a little decent storage unit let's put some item frames on here to make it look a little bit fancy we're gonna place some stairs on the top half here so that way i can actually open up these chests i put a chest plate right in here and all my armor is gonna go inside of this chest i actually never really took in how much armor i had until i was actually filling up these chests part of me does feel a little bit refreshed like i get to start fresh but i get to come back to an account that is absolutely giga jacked okay so all my wardrobes here are clear and inside this chest is all the armor that I have. I have a backpack full of tools, so I'm gonna put this axe in here. Here are all my tools. I just took gonna actually have more armor. I'm gonna put this entire bag in here and all my tools in here. I do have this greater backpack here. I'm gonna put it at the very bottom. And I have all these jumbo backpacks and everything just full 
of graders. I actually have more talismans that I still need to recombobulate, but because talismans are basically tools, I'm going to put this bag in here as well. I also have a bunch of weapons in here, but I don't want to make more chests for no reason. So I put it in the armor chest as well. So one thing I quickly wanted to add is that I'm going to be keeping all my accessories. I'm not going to get all my accessories all over again. I mean, half of the items are untradeable and recombobulating it would be an absolute pain. It'd be very unnecessary for the series. And to be brutally honest, half the things that you do in this game, you don't need to have some crazy stat boost. And I'm talking about in the combat department. It does help a lot if I'm going to be doing money makers that have to do with dungeons. We'll see as far as we go. But for the sake of my mental, I am going to keep my talismans. Okay, let's go ahead and lock up this portion right here. I'm going to put a skull in here and I'm going to put an endstone rose in here. And this basically just means farewell to all my items. Okay, so you probably thought I was done there. And all I have to do now is just kind of grind and get my 1 billion coins. It is not that easy considering I have all these minions to help me. Yup, you already know what that means. I'm taking all my minions out. Everything from the hamster wheels, minion expanders, super compactors, everything. It's all going in a chest. So you have that correct. I have 29 minion slots that I'm going to have to go ahead and replenish. This series is not going to be easy. And I'm going to try at its fullest extent to show you guys that it is possible to get 1 bill. And you can get it quick if you put your mind to it. If any of you guys have been scammed or any of you guys been you know been stabbed in the back by somebody you can't trust anybody quit this game you're coming back into the game right now you don't know what to do you guys can follow my steps and have some fun with it realize that this is all just a game and we all can have fun that being said i think it's a great time for me to plug my discord discord.gg slash verlo if you guys want some friends or somebody to talk to as you guys are fishing or trying to figure out some stuff you guys can head over to my cord there are some really nice people there okay so once again these minions have a crap ton of clay in them because i'm trying to cheese my fishing i honestly hate fishing so on top of all these clay minions that i'm gonna have to harvest up and put into a chest i'm gonna have to take all the clay and then just sell it to the merchant so if you guys are curious i'm gonna go ahead and claim all the minions i'm gonna tell you how much xp i get and all the coins that i get from it so i'll be right back okay so as you can see here i basically removed every single minion you can see that i neatly packed it into a jumbo bag here when i started harvesting this you'll see in a screenshot right here i started at fishing level 33 i think i was around 900k and then i actually leveled up to level 34 around 340k so i think i did the math correctly it's around like 900 950k experience that I got for harvesting everything. And if you guys also look at my balance here, I made around 17 million, which is actually stonks. Obviously, this money I can't use. I'm going to put it back in my bank here, and I actually have to liquidate this cash here, so we'll see what we spend our money on. One thing that I also wanted to mention is that I am going to be using my pets throughout this as well, and I'm not going to be picking up new pets. The reason for this is because I would actually have to spend more time leveling up the pet so that way it could actually be useful rather than getting the 1 billion coins. If the series was more for like skill experience and maybe trying to get average 50, it would be a completely different story. Story, but it's not in this case as you can see we have 148 mil and i honestly don't know what else to spend my money on so let's just grab one of the last artifacts that i need here i also just bought myself a forceful bat person artifact and i'm going to go ahead and recombine it myself okay so we're going to make this mythic here and we're going to go ahead and make this epic we're going to use our magic find enrichment here and then just finish up our talismans okay so we just got strong on here and our talisman optimizer tells us to get strange on our epic talismans okay so we successfully have every single talisman in the game now all recombobulated and i put enriched on all of them the rest of the money here i'm going to go ahead and place a buy order so that way if i ever need to buy a cosmetic off the auction house i can the rest of the money here i have 310 coins and i'm sure you guys won't cancel me for having this much anyways you guys can look forward to more zero to one bill series and episodes coming through if you guys do enjoy them please leave a like and subscribe because i really do like entertaining you guys and making these videos i'm gonna stop dragging on this video and i'll see you guys in the next one